The last budget session of the 10th Parliament began on Tuesday. A huge crowd of people continued today at Komalapur railway station to fetch train tickets. And bodies of four minor boys recovered from a pond of Chatpur district. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome to My TV News. I'm Fozar Shunakta with you in the newsroom today. We also are watching Standard Bank headlines. Now the details. The last budget session of the 10th Parliament began on Tuesday. This will be the fifth budget session of the current Parliament, which began at 11.15 a.m. with Speaker Dr. Shreen Sharmi Chaudhry in the chair. According to the decision, the session will run every day from 10.30 a.m. onwards until July 12. Finance Minister A.M. Mohit will place the budget at 12.30 p.m. on June 7. Finance Minister A.M. Mohit is going to place a TAKA 4,68,200 crore budget for the 2018-2019 to fiscal year. This will be the highest number of budget given by any Finance Minister of Bangladesh. A huge crowd of people continued today at Komalapur railway station to fetch train tickets for going home to celebrate Eid al Fitr to avoid the terrorism traffic congestion on highways. During visit on Tuesday, it was seen that Bangladesh Railways continued its selling advanced tickets of train service for June 14. However, many people spent whole night at the railway station to get their tickets. Each passenger is being allowed to procure maximum four tickets, and the tickets sold earlier are not being returned. BNP chairperson Khalid Azia has filed a bail petition with the High Court seeking bail in an arson attack case in Kumilla. Masood Rana, one of Khalid's lawyers on Tuesday, said the hearing would be held at the 8th bench of Justice Muhammad Shaukat Hussain and Justice Abu Tahir Muhammad Saif Rahman within a day or two. On February 3, 2015, police filed the case with the Chodugram Police Station for instigating an arson attack on a bus on Dhaka Chitong Highway in Kumilla. Bodies of four minor boys were recovered from a pond in Radhurigam village in Hajigans municipality of Chapur district on Tuesday, a day after they went missing. The deceased were identified as Rahul, Shamim, Raihan and Leon. The age of the deceased is around 8 to 11 years. Police said the minors went missing on Monday evening while they were playing beside the pond. Locals suspected that they might have slipped into the pond while playing and drowned there. Later in the morning, victims' family members found their floating bodies in the pond. A Yaba trader named Rigan was killed in a gunfight with police in the Madhutali area of Bogra early Tuesday. The deceased was the son of Abdul Kashem on Chok Sutrapur. Police said a police team conducted an anti narcotics drive in the area around 4 a.m. Sensing presence of the law enforcers, a gang of drug traders opened fire on them, prompting them to retaliate for self-defense that triggered a gunfight. At one stage, Leeton was caught in the line of fire and injured critically with other managed to flee the scene. Viewers, that's all from our newsroom for now. Thanks for being with us. To join with My TV News online, visit www.youtube.com slash News. And to watch all our programs on YouTube, visit youtube.com slash Bangla. Our next bulletin will be telecast in Bangla at 7.30 p.m. Don't forget to join with us. Till then, stay connected. Allah Hafiz.